So welcome to the video lecture series on uh, Polytechnic Teachers Recruitment Board. <clears throat> In today's uh, video lecture, we will be learning about number systems, uh, which comes under the subject of uh, digital logic. So uh, basically, there are uh, four types of number systems as far as digital circuit is concerned. Uh, decimal, where uh, the base is 10, and for binary, it is base is 2. Octal, the base is 8, and hexadecimal, the base is 60. So the question will be focused on conversion of this uh, number systems. For instance, a decimal number can be asked to be converted to a binary and uh, uh, octal number will be asked to be converted to hexadecimal, so on and so forth. So this kind of uh, questions will be asked. So we will just uh, learn about uh, the conversion techniques one by one. Uh, for instance, I want to convert a decimal number. So I want to convert uh, convert a decimal number uh, 78 okay so decimal number is actually uh, base is actually 10 uh, to to a binary number to a binary so uh, since we want to convert to a binary uh, the binary base is actually 2 so uh, we to or not to convert to a uh, decimal number to binary I divide this 78 by 2 and uh, when you divide this 78 by 2 you will get uh, half of the value 39 and the remainder you don't have any value 0 and again when you divide this by 2 and uh, you will get the answer called as uh, nineteen. Okay, and the remainder is actually 1. Again, when you divide it by 2, uh, you will get uh, 9. And again, the remainder is 1. And again, when you divide by 2, uh, you get uh, 4. And the remainder is 1. And when you divide it by 2, you actually have 2 value and the remainder is 0. And final value is 2 divided by 2, actually remainder is 1 and you don't have any uh, uh, reminder so write it as 0 so now while you represent a binary number just try to write from top to the bottom to top so you start from 1 and just carry forward this one okay now if you write it uh, the converted uh, binary number will be 1 0 0 1 1 1 and 0 okay so uh, binary base is actually 2 so you can write like this so uh, this is how uh, you can actually convert a decimal number uh, to a binary number for instance suppose if uh, a decimal number is actually given in fractions what you have to do uh, we will uh, have an example let us assume that uh, I want to convert Uh, convert uh, a number uh, for example 35.56 uh, okay 35.56 so the base is actually 10 uh, we want to convert that into a binary now uh, this has actually two portions here one is 35 and another is fraction part is 56 so first we will actually convert the uh, non-fractional part that is 35 so 35 divided by 2 have 17 and the remainder is 1 17 divided by 2 uh, you have 8 and the remainder is again 1 and again when you divide it by 2 4 and the remainder is 0 and now when you divide by 2 uh, 4 2 remainder is 0 and finally when you divide by 2 uh, you have 1 and the remainder is 0 okay so uh, the main portion has been done now we will actually come to the fractional part when you come to the fractional part um, it is actually 0.56 okay so when it is 0.56 what you have to do is you have to multiply by the base value of 2 binary base value so now you take this 0.56 into 2 okay now 0.56 into 2 will become uh, 1.12 isn't it so you will have 
1.12 okay but while you multiply the second time you should not take this one okay one will be actually written like this now one point this point two should be taken it only the fractional part you have to multiply so now point two into two will become zero point two four okay now you see only the fractional part now zero point two four into two is equal to zero point four eight okay now uh, point four eight 0.48 into 2 is equal to we can write 0 0.96 now you take this 0 0.96 0 0.96 into 2 is equal to 1.92 okay now uh, you can just go upon multiplying that up to this uh, level it is sufficient okay now we have to write the binary value so how to write the binary value so this is a non-fractional part from bottom to top so when you write it you will get one zero 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 one and one okay and now you write the fractional part so how to write the fractional part fractional part you have to start from the top now uh, what is the value before this dot what is the value before this dot you have one so you write one here next value is 0 again write 0 and the next value is again 0 write 0 and here the fourth value is again 0 write 0 and the last value is 1 you can write this one so this is called as the binary value for, uh, for uh, decimal point uh, fractional uh, for the decimal number with fractional value okay so uh, this is how you can compute uh, for a decimal value okay now we will go for the uh, next one for instance uh, let us uh, we want to convert uh, a decimal number to an octal number example so convert so I want to convert a number called as 36 uh, to the pound 10 to octal Okay, so now what is the octal base? Octal base is actually 8. The simple procedure for uh, uh, this is actually divide this 36 by 8 here. Divide this 36 by 8 and when you divide it and it goes 4 times and the remainder is 4. Okay, and you cannot divide this 4 again. Okay, 4 is actually the quotient and 4 is remainder. So you just write it from... Uh, uh, top uh, bottom to top so you will get the value called as 44 to the power of 8 okay so we will actually compute uh, uh, one more uh, problem based on 74 okay so convert convert 174 to uh, to octal so if you want to convert that I can make 174 divided by 8 174 divided by 8 is actually uh, it goes uh, 21 times it goes 22 times it goes for 22 times and uh, the remainder is okay 168 Okay, it goes for 21 times and the remainder is actually 6. Okay, now when you take up this 21, 21 can also be divided by 8 and uh, so it goes 2 times and the remainder is actually 5 here. Now, uh, uh, 2 cannot be divided further so you can just write from bottom to top. So the answer is 256 divided by 8 sorry basis actually eight. this is called as octal number for the above mentioned uh, uh, decimal number now uh, we will go for uh, a fractional part here let us assume that convert convert uh, 12 point 12 point uh, 
थ्री टू ट्वेल्व पॉइंट थ्री टू टू ओके नाउ वेरी सिंपल जस्ट दिस इज अ नॉन फ्रैक्शनल पार्ट जस्ट कन्वर्ट दैट सो ट्वेल्व डिवाइडेड बाई एट सो इट गोज वन टाइम एंड द रिमाइंडर इज फोर सो वी वी हैव टू राइट इन दिस ऑर्डर नाउ टेक दिस थर्टी टू so 32 now you have to multiply by 8 here okay multiply by 8 so uh, 0.32 <coughs> will be uh, when you just multiply this 0.32 uh, we will have uh, uh, 3 into 8 is 24 uh, 2. Or six, okay. So we'll have uh, into eight. Okay, it is two point five six. Two point five six is an answer. Okay. Now only you take this uh, fractional part. So point five six and two eight. Again, when you take point six five six into eight, uh, you can say that four hundred four into six is uh, forty eight. Okay, so four point four eight will be the answer. Okay, so four point four eight. Now four point six four. Okay, four point six four will be the answer. Now we will make this uh, take this two one four here. So now when you write uh, this one, uh, we will convert this fourteen. So fourteen we will write here. And when you write the fractional part, you just take take what is the first digit before the decimal point. That is two. And what is the second digit? It is four. So the answer is actually. Fourteen point two four, the power of eight here. Okay, so this is how you can convert uh, this into an octal number. So thanks for watching the video. Have a good day.